All right, considering I don't put any money into this game and never have, I got something a little bit different that I wanted to talk about. Um, I noticed yesterday that they have this new Lightspeed Bundle pack that gives you Kiedi Mundi at 7 stars and Relic 5 right out the gate just from, from buying this thing. And it's only 20 bucks. Obviously, it has a purchase limit of 1 because there's, <laughs> there's really no value after that. But, um, yeah, I feel like this quite possibly could be a pretty good deal. If, if you're not close to unlocking Kiati Mundi, you're a newer, newer player, and, you know what I mean, you've got a long ways to go, <laughs> you can unlock Kiati Mundi right now for 20 bucks. I mean, Kiati Mundi is a, a character that, I don't know, he's probably been in the game for maybe five years now. Um, and... It's just got the longest, slowest grind to unlock him. I mean, I just unlocked the the guy, what, two months ago? Maybe one month ago? Nah, probably two months ago. And, I mean, I've been playing this game since Christmas Day 2015. I'm, I've almost been playing since day one. Day one was sometime around Thanksgiving. I was a month late to the party. <laughs> and it took me five years to unlock... The, uh, yeah, five years to unlock this guy, from his introduction to just unlocking him a couple days ago. And mostly, that's because he's only available from, uh, where the heck is it? This special currency that you get from <sighs> raids. Uh, where is it? I don't even know what I'm looking for. This. He's only available in this type of currency up here. And, and on top of that, he's only available when the game chooses to make him available. Like, he's noticed how he's not there now. They have Wat Tambor and Maul. So maybe at the refresh he'd be there, maybe not. So that's the other thing. It's, it's a matter of A, having this currency, and B, having the RNG in your favor so that way then he's there and you actually can purchase him. The other part is he's expensive. Like you notice these two, 1750 and 2125. I mean, 2125 is kind of expensive. But Kiedi Mundi is up there as well. He's either like 2125 or it's worse. I don't remember offhand. But, um, yeah, so you need to have the currency, have a lot of the currency, <laughs> and have the luck that he's going to show up here so you can actually buy him. I mean, other than that, Kiati Mundi, I think, is available nowhere. Uh, let's see, we'll go Galactic Republic. I just want to find the character and see when you do, um, when you search for his shards, what it says. So, Kiati Mundi, this, Yeah. Nowhere. Only this pack. <laughs> so, he is quite a pain in the dick to get. I can't say he's really that good. Um, because any time that I've gone up against a team that has him in it, I'm able to easily take him out. <laughs> he's usually one of the first ones to fall. So, but still, as far as, like, rarity, I guess you could say, goes... Like, it's up there just because of how difficult he is to get. He's harder to unlock than GL is. Jeez, yeah, GLs might take you a while to meet all the requirements and stuff. I remember when the GLs first came out, it took me about a year and a half, I think, to unlock Supreme Leader Kylo to, you know, meet all the requirements and stuff, complete the event. But a year and a half is still a lot faster than five years. Jeez, I had, I had what, seven GLs or six GLs by the time I unlocked this guy? <laughs> He came out way before GLs were even a thing. And yet, I was still able to get five GLs before unlocking him. So, yeah. He is quite the pain in the butt to, to unlock. It takes absolutely forever. And, um... Yeah. So, in order to speed things up, maybe buy that pack. Plus, you get him straight to Relic 5 as well. So, it's like, for 20 bucks, not only are you unlocking him very fast... <laughs> And at 7 star. But you're able to take him right to Relic 5. So, like, he's ridiculously viable right out the gate for 20 bucks. It's not bad. Um, so, yeah. I just wanted to show that. It, uh, we only have, like, a week. At this time of me recording, it says there's 5 days left. So, get in there if you're interested. Buy this thing and get a kind of rare, difficult-to-get character right away. And get him pretty beefy right out the gate, too. <laughs> um, that's all I got. I just wanted to comment on this because um it's actually a pretty decent uh light speed bundle like we've had past light speed bundles that are kind of better you could argue like we had the one for um the first order i think you got what five characters and you could take them all the relic five so in comparison it's like well geez that was wasn't that like a ten dollar pack too 
So it's like for 10 bucks, I was able to get five characters of Relic 5, but it's like, yeah, but those were those were easy to farm characters. This is different. This is a, 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 an extremely challenging character to farm. And a huge farm at that. <laughs> so 20 bucks for it, pretty solid. If you, if you don't have him, if you're far from unlocking him, I mean, if you're close, you're relic, you, you got him at six stars, don't waste your money. But, you know, if you don't even have any progress at all towards this guy, or you have a little bit, like, he's not unlocked, but you're close, you're at, like, you know, 70 out of 80 shards, buy this thing, speed up that process. Save years off of a grind to get this mediocre, I don't know what you want to call him, uh, not marquee character, but legendary character, I guess. Um, yeah, so that's all I got. Um, thanks for checking this out. And, uh... Maybe check out that pack, and until next time, I should see ya.